salad, which I'm gonna be making a nice, lovely salad. This evening, we've been talking about this collaboration for a very long time, but as I said, nothing never done before the time. There's nothing on this earth can beat time. Time is so important, all right? Um, I did a salad recipe yesterday, which I was gonna be doing the collaboration, but yesterday was my meat free Monday and I didn't wanna do it on my meat free Monday. So that's why um, I take the time this evening to do this beautiful collaboration with Susie. With Curtis Sue. All right. Now, um, yeah, it's, it's, to be honest with you, it's going to be something I would encourage you guys. You know what I mean? Just share the video, tell a friend, and a friend, tell a friend. And um, we're definitely going to show you exactly how to do this amazing one. You know what I mean? Um, it's so. <laughs> Curly Sue. Um, it's so funny and so weird because. <laughs> To be honest with you, she's a vegan lady, and um, I would encourage you guys to check out our YouTube channel if you guys um want to learn some vegan ideas and vegan stuff. And to be honest with you, so amazing because you see, God is so good because God works things in our way where you can never believe. Uh, um, Craig, what's going on? Robin, thank you so much because um, she was one of the judge who was judging me with my cooking. You know what I mean when I um was doing my when we was doing that TV um production. Um she was was one of the one of the judge and I said to her I'd love to do a collaboration with you. Curly Sue. So um please check out our YouTube channel and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Alright? Yeah please check out our YouTube channel and share the love guys honestly. Yeah it's it's so weird because you know what I mean I said to her I'd love to do a collaboration and it end up happening now she's a vegan chef okay um as i said she's a vegan chef you guys can check out our youtube channel and you can support our man she was one of the judge who was judging me when i was doing my cooking it's so weird and today i can be able to do a collaboration guys it is amazing you know what i mean yeah um yeah so please check out our youtube channel and share some love with them all right i'm gonna be doing a salad recipe this evening because as i said before um i'm gonna be doing salad for the next couple of days please share the video please tell a friend and a friend tell a friend all right yeah man so yeah that would be that would be amazing if you guys can you know what i mean that's just share the love guys it's simple but you know what i mean it can be done all right yeah it can be done so as i say yeah, please share the video. Please tell a friend and a friend tell a friend. We've got a lot more recipes coming and a lot more ideas will be coming from Chef Ricardo. And don't forget to click in the notification bell. All on the first, guys. Before I even start the show, I'm going to wait till I reach at least 20 likes. All right. So far, we at what? 10. Let's get another 10 likes. And I'm really happy with that. All right. Yeah, beautiful one. So basically, as, as I said before, um, she was one of the judge who was judging me with my cooking back in back then when I was doing that production. All right. And today I can be able to say, you know what, big um I'm doing my collaboration with um Curly Sue Kitchen Cooking Curly Sue YouTube channel. It's amazing, guys. Yeah. Um they, they are amazing, a lot of TV production, a lot of stuff, they, you know what I mean, TV station. But the most important thing, you can follow on our Instagram, on our Facebook page, on our YouTube channel, and check her out, guys. All right? To learn some vegan recipe. That's what I'm talking about, you know, it's a vegan recipe. And that's the reason why I didn't really want to do it. All right, we got 27 likes. Thank you so much. Let's shout out. Venice. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that one. Professor, 84. Thank you so much for coming on the show. Is this out though? Here's the Zim. Thank you so much. All the way from Guyana. Thank you so much. Mario Robbins. Thank you. So yeah, I'm going to be making a simple salad like what I did yesterday. But just a similar same way. But a little bit of tweaking towards it. I'm going to be giving you guys a little bit of tweaking. Um, tomorrow, we're going to be doing salad tomorrow. Um, we're going to be salad for the rest of the week. All right. So we're going to make it you know, like a pomegranate seed salad this evening. All right. So hope you guys, 
we enjoy this one. Sharon Bentley, thank you so much for coming on the show. We appreciate the love, 100%. Ryan Claude, what's going on, chef? Big up yourself, man. Long time, innit? Joyce, thank you so much. You're welcome, you're welcome. Eric, thank you so much for coming on the show. Appreciate it. All right, shout out to every one of you guys. If I don't shout you out, Chef Ricardo still love you, and that's the greatest thing right now, all right? That's the most powerfulest thing I could ever hear, all right? Chef Ricardo still love you, and honestly, it is amazing, all right? Yeah, so, all right. Now, this evening, we're going to make a pomegranate seed salad, all right? But it's going to be similar like yesterday one, but it's going to be totally different. It's going to have a lot of flavor to it. It's going to be a lot of things to it. All the way from London, thank you so much for coming on the show. AMB, thank you so much. All right, Sharon, thank you so much. All right. Now, we're going to make a beautiful salad this evening. All right, and it's going to be similar like yesterday's salad, but it's going to be a little bit, a little bit, a different tweak to it today. All right. Yeah, it's going to be a little bit, a different kind of way. Wow, the salad looks like you want to get a little bit of fresh up on it. All right. So first of all, we have the bean left over from yesterday. And this is what we're going to be doing this evening. We're going to be showing you exactly. So this, this week, as I say, we're just doing salad for one week straight. I'm going to use up the rest of my, my beans right here. Tomorrow will be another salad. We're going to be doing salad for the rest of the week. All right. Be a salad for the rest of the week. So, John Chef Ricardo on the salad. One week with a salad and detoxing of the body. All right. In the meantime, what I've been drinking, I've been drinking some cloves water right here. Some cloves with hot water at the moment. That's what I'm drinking right here. You know what I mean? Sometimes I've been working and I've been doing my video. But at the same time, I've been drinking a nice, lovely cup of tea. All right. So, right here, this is what I've been drinking. All right, here it is. Cloves with hot water. You can do the same thing. You can have your kitchen and a cook, and you do certain things, and you just make yourself a cup of ginger tea or, or a cup of um, lemon tea and drink it in the meantime. Cook Chef, thank you so much for coming on the show. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so sometimes you can do that, guys, honestly. All right, so we're going to cut up some cucumber. All right. So we're gonna get some cucumber, and as you can see, that's the cucumber right here. Lovely and nice, all right. And we got some radish. I don't know if you guys eat radish, but I love radish. I'm always eating, man. Yeah. Yeah, when I'm when I'm cutting, I'm always trying my best not to make too much. You know what I mean? <laughs> I just have to be careful. All right. So we got some bean, we got some radish, and also I think I got. Oh yes, I find one more radish. I don't know if you guys eat radish, but I love radish. All right. I'm always eating radish. All right, that's the radish. Just like that, all right? Now, please share the video. Please tell a friend. And a friend tell a friend. And I say, please check out Susie, Susie Kitchen YouTube channel, guys. All right? Um, if you want to learn some vegan, it's a collaboration. If you want to learn some vegan, yeah, that's the place you need to go. Honestly. Curly Sue Kitchen. Check out it. Check out our YouTube channel, guys. Now I'm gonna cut up some tomato. All right, lovely. So that's some tomato. All right, lovely and nice. Look at that. Yeah. That is excellent. That looking good so far. All right. 
So. gonna be getting some beetroot all right the beetroot in the vinegar you know guys honestly that that beetroot is a very lovely beetroot to have the one in the vinegar where you can have it with a salad but the fresh organic one is that the one i use to make juice all right i don't use this one to make juice i just use this one on my salad when i'm having my salad all right yeah yeah man, that's the one I, I normally intend to have. Yeah, when I'm having my salad, I have this one. But otherwise, yeah man, the other beetroot is yeah lovely to have. I'm just gonna put some some of the mixed leaf right here, sir. In the middle. Alright. Yeah. Mixed leaf right here, sir. Lovely and nice. Yeah, so as you guys can see, this is what we did yesterday. Something similar like this, but my, this one I'm, I'm gonna have a little bit of tweak to it. All right, beautiful. All right, got some purple onion. Oh yeah, Chef Ricardo, that looking good. That looks amazing and delicious, honestly. Look at that. We got some purple onion on it. And now we're gonna put some jelly peanut. I love my jelly peanut, guys. I don't know about you, but I'm always having my, my jelly peanut, you know? I'm gonna put some right here, sir. Yeah. Now that looking good. That looking excellent. That's what I'm talking about. Now, um, I'm gonna get some some red cabbage. Now, this red cabbage is in vinegar. Nice, guys. When I have the, the, this kind of vinegar, this one. Let's put this one right here, sir. Red cabbage in vinegar. That is amazing. All right, I bought this one in the head shop. Lovely and nice. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Now, we're gonna get some, some olive. All right, we're not gonna be getting too much olive because we're just gonna put a few olive on it, on the plate, like this. Oh yes, Chef Ricardo cooking. That's what I'm talking about. Um, yeah. All right. Then what we're gonna do? All right. We're gonna um get some peppers. All right. Let's get some pepper, guys. Nothing beat peppers. All right. Yeah. Yeah, man. Get some peppers. And put on it. Can't go wrong with pepper, guys. Honestly. All right. Yeah. I love my pepper, man. Yeah. Look at that. Lovely and nice. That is beautiful. I love my peppers. Honestly. So I'm gonna use both three colors, all right? Wow, excellent Chef Ricardo. That is the masterpiece right there then. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna get some of your favorite, all right? Yeah, here it is, avocado. I eat this kind of salad and you know have avocado on the plate. That will be wasting a time. Yes. So right here, I'm just scraping out some avocado. 
right here and put it right here so you have to have a little bit of an avocado on the plate with this kind of salad wow that is amazing now look at this plate of salad guys exactly what i'm talking about straight up to the maximum with this plate of salad you can do the same thing at home 100 percent all right guys all you have to do is get your little bits and pieces and put it together on a plate and trust me it's gonna come out lovely like this if you got some fresh coriander put a little bit of fresh coriander on it and trust me you guys will love this honestly 100 percent lick a bit of black pepper on it i mean because you know the thing already we have to have a little bit of black pepper all right um yeah i think i got a little bit uh chili let's put a little bit of chili on it i mean get a little bit of spice and all them thing there now to be honest with you i do have special um i do have special um we call it fat free vinegar jason right here this one is not me make this one, but I can make mine. It's easy to make. All right. Can make a nice sweet chili sauce one. I can make all different ones. This, this one is a fat free um, dressing right here. Vinegar dressing. So if all of the ladies them who decide they want to run up on them at the park, they love salad and they love dressing for them salad, can get this one in the supermarket. Just look for the one that said fat free salad dressing. Very, very nice one. Yeah. I brought it in the supermarket. So it's kind of simple. Put a little bit of the on it, you know what I mean? Very little bit on it. And trust me, it's beautiful and I love the flavor of it. All right? Now, before I go in any more further, let's get the like up to 60, guys. 60 likes and then I'm going to close. And I'm going to have to close the show because, you know what I mean? And the guys not like, like the video. Oops. All right. Now, this is going to be the uh, finished product just to show you guys and what's going on. All right, so right here, this is what's gonna happen. So that's the salad. So we're gonna put a little bit of pomegranate seed on top of it. Now the pomegranate seed, all right guys, to be honest with you, you guys can have the pomegranate seed. You can eat pomegranate seed on its own, just like that. Now, if you like that guys, leave your comments in the description box. Tomorrow will be salad day. Tomorrow is what, Thursday, Wednesday? We're gonna have salad tomorrow. And salad Thursday and salad Friday. All right. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah. okay, lovely. So tomorrow gonna be salad day again. So if you wanna join Chef Ricardo, we gonna be doing Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Five days salad for dinner. If you eat chicken and rice at the, in the evening, that's three red flag. All right. We're doing. You can have a piece of fish. Or you can have a, a boiled egg, you know what I mean, because of protein and if you're on medication and all them stuff. But if you're not on medication, that's different. Giant Chef Ricardo for five days, salad every evening, Monday to Friday. All right? The salad in the evening. Just to help you guys to stop eat red meat and chicken and beef and lamb and pork. All right? Leave the meat for a week. You know what I mean? One week can kill you. 365 days for the year. Leave the meat for a little bit of time. Cut, cut off the meat. Just say to yourself, one week, I'm going to eat some salad. Drink a lot of green juice and all these things. All right? Yeah, man. One week can't kill you guys. One week out of 365 days for the year, won't be able to kill you. So you must can do this with Chef Ricardo. Five days with a salad. Healthy, healthy salad. Drink up some green juice and eat some salad and some stir-fried vegetable or whatever what makes you happy at home. But... Let's give the meat a break, man. Every day you know, get up with chicken, beef, chicken, beef, lamb, um, fish. Um, what do you call the next one again? Tin mackerel. Corn beef. You know what I mean? Eat some greens. You know what I mean? When you go to the toilet, you don't have any problem. So you need greens in your body to free slowly. You know what I mean? You don't have to hear your kids them. Dad, I need to use the toilet and all them stuff there. So when you eat a lot of vegetables like this, this is what gonna make your body different. Anyway, this is finished. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna be making a quick juice. All right, let's move the Dutchie. All right, Dutchie was only for decoration. 
All right, let's make a quick juice. All right, this one is for high blood pressure. If you're suffering from high blood pressure, you can do this one at home, guys. Very, very good for you. All right, high blood pressure. This is what you want to do. All right, if you're at home and you're suffering from high blood pressure, go in the kitchen, get yourself some pomegranate seed like this. All right, pomegranate seed. And I'm going to simply show you exactly what you can do at home. Beautiful one. Pomegranate seed, very good for lowering your sugar level and also high blood pressure with a beautiful salad like this. All right, and it's simple. Pomegranate seed, simple one. All right, and then what we're going to do next is mm -hmm. get some water. All right, as I said, this is a collaboration, guys. Please check out our YouTube channel and support and share the love, all right? Yeah, now we're gonna get some water. All right, roughly one cup of water. All right, guys, one cup of water inside of it. All right, and then what you're gonna do, let's put a pinch of apple cider vinegar, just a pinch, not too much of apple cider vinegar. And secondly, you don't need to add any ginger to this. You want to do it naturally. All right. So naturally is much better for you at home. All right. So let's blend up this and make some noise. Lovely and nice. All right, that sound really quick and simple. All right, then once you blend it up, you just strain it. Run it through your strainer. All right, just like this. Simple, guys. Doesn't complicate it. Go to the supermarket. All right, guys, let's get the like to 100 likes and I will be happy. All right, so this one right here, just want to drink this kind of way. I'm going to show you exactly what you need to do next. All right, let's get the light to 100 before I move to the next level, guys. All right, let's get the light up, guys. Let's, let's light the video, light the video, light the video. That's all I've been asking, nothing else. All right, let's light the video. 76, let's get it up there, guys. 100, let's get the light to 100. All right. Now, this, you can't have this, guys. So we have to squeeze out this. All right. Um, GS4, ah, never eat meat anymore. <laughs> nice one. <laughs> yeah, let's get the light up, guys. Yeah, man. All of the people that will cut off a meat. Congratulations. Alright. Now, what we're going to do is. Alright, guys. Get. We're going to get half of a lemon. Let's get the light like, 200, guys. We're going to have 86. Half of a lemon. Make sure you get the lemon where you got seed in it. Alright. Or you can use lime. Squeeze out that lime, that lemon juice. All right, just like this. All right, give that a mix. All right. Then pour it into a glass like this. All right. And then let's taste it and see what's going on. Cheers. Oh, thank the Lord, the Lord is very nice. Now, this is a very powerful drink where a lot of people doesn't know. I would encourage you guys to drink something like this at home, all right? All right? Yeah, right here. Beautiful. Oh, yes. Pomegranate seed, apple cider vinegar with some lemon juice or lime juice.
all right yeah oh, that is beautiful fantastic i love it mm. oh yeah nice one guys so here it is that's the salad that looks amazing and fantastic thank every one of you guys who are taking the time and watching the video and appreciate it all right we're talking about positivity not negativity but positivity any negativity that's red flag now appreciate it i'm just trying to say guys you can eat healthy sometime and you know what i mean sometimes it's not going to be easy because we all love our food but at the end of the day you know what i mean you can eat a little bit healthy at home it's not going to be rocket science a lot of people oh i don't eat i have to eat meat all right why be did you use a um, this bean, this bean right over here, this is a mixed bean which I brought in the supermarket. Um, I didn't cook my own bean, but it's a very good bean, you know what I mean? Which I know I've been using that bean over a couple of years well now, so I, I, I'm familiar with that bean. It's a very um, bean which I used to, and to be honest with you, there's no red flag in it. It's a very good bean into um, vinegar. It's like a salad bean, but you can get your own bean and you can cook it if you like to. But at the end of the day, none of them is not a rocket science. It's not going to be, you know what I mean, like do your harm and danger. You know what I mean? I've been using this for many years. So I know. What's the bean? Is it? Um, if you go into the supermarket, you can look for mixed bean salad. Yeah. It look, yeah. It's like, um, so right here, this is the bean right here. What I've been using. It's a mixed bean. It's got red kidney bean. It's got sweet corn. So it's like, a, it's a thin bean. Beautiful. I've been using it for, for a very long time. I'm familiar with it. I was wondering what kind of bean that. In there. Okay. Yeah, it's a mixed bean. Go into the supermarket and you can look for mixed bean salad. That's the one I'm using. All right. And it's a lovely bean. And sometimes you can cook your own bean if you've got that time. But for a nine to five parents who are have to come home and deal with that three four kids doesn't have time to cook bean you know what i mean so sometimes if you just tap at the supermarket and grab something fantastic and just go home and wrap up a salad all right yeah but anyway guys i really appreciate every one of you guys this evening join me tomorrow yeah um it's got red kidney bean in it it got red cabbage it got Got a lot of different kind of bits and pieces on the plate. You can use whatever kind of stuff you have at home in your fridge can make a beautiful salad. You can just do that. You can use couscous. You can use so many things to make salad at home. I'm just simply saying to you, you know what I mean? John Chef Ricardo for a week and let's eat salad. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. You don't have to make the salad which I made. You can make yourself some lovely salad at home for yourself. And be happy. So tomorrow I will be doing a different kind of a salad. You know what I mean? So I'm just simply saying, whatever you guys have at home, you can use it and make a salad. You know what I mean? Sometimes it's good for you to just cut off a red meat and chicken. That's all I'm saying. And eat some salad. So sometimes I will be doing a five-day detoxing water. Sometimes I do a five-day detoxing drinks. Sometimes I do a five-day beetroot carrot juice all different kind of stuff we do for five days you know what i mean the break the good news is a lot of people try it and it works for them some people don't because they don't have the time but they have to work you know what i mean some people try it and they be I, I got a lot of people saying to me chef ricardo this this been healed this been happened to me and i've been suffering for certain things for many years and now i'm feeling much better lots of people reach out to me with those kind of talk some, the last one which was so happy, this lady was on medication for a very long time for high blood pressure. And she was drinking the beetroot juice every single day. And what happened? When she went back to the doctor, the doctor said she can come off a high blood pressure pill. Now, you change your diet, you start to do certain things in the right and proper way. You know what I mean? Just like a baby. You know the baby going to creep before you walk. All right? So what you want to do, you want to go back into that stage. You know what I mean? Change your diet change certain kind of lifestyle and you know what i mean you don't you, you you may suffer from high blood pressure and at the same time you eat rice three times for the week you know what i mean you suffer from high blood pressure you're still drinking 
You're still doing a lot of stuff. You know what I mean? Because you, and you're still going to stress out yourself. So I'm simply saying to you, you don't have to stress out yourself. By simple, do a few little things at home. Exercise. You know what I mean? Take certain things off your mind and get yourself normal. You know what I mean? 42 year old lady or a 42 year old man suffering from certain kind of symptoms. That shouldn't be happening. You're too young for that. You know what I mean? And what is happening? Even 22 year old, 32 year old. Come on. You know what I mean? But as I say, you're an adult. You have to make your own decision and you start right in your house, in your kitchen. You know what I mean? Because when you open your fridge, you're going to see things. So, you know what I mean? I when you hope in your, your storeroom, you're going to see things. So, you start right at home in your kitchen. All right? But anyway, as I said, we could talk and talk and talk and talk. Stacy, good morning. Thank you so much. All right? Stir-fried vegetable. Put on the salad. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes, yes. I'm telling you. Like, like yesterday, I did barley. All right? This is, this is what I normally buy. All right? Bulgar. So this is bulgar. Alright. Some people can't have wheat because they're allergic to it. But this is better than rice. Alright. You go to the supermarket. Try these things, guys. You know what I mean? You can use bulgar and make jollof rice. You know what I mean? Yeah, so it's a lot of stuff you guys can do at home with bulgar. Um, you got barley. Alright, you got barley. And you got bulgur. Alright? So all of these things do work at home. You go to the supermarket and you look at the shelf. Try some of these things at home, guys. You know what I mean? Cut out the rice and cut out certain kind of stuff and eat certain kind of food sometimes. It's not easy, but at least you're going to try. You know what I mean? It's not going to happen overnight. Alright? Drink a, nat a lot of natural tea. Wake up in the morning and you drink some clove tea. Are you drink ginger tea, mint tea, green tea, all sort of stuff you can do. But anyway, it's a collaboration, and I'm straying away from the collaboration. But it is a salad, do the collaboration. We will be coming with part two because we need to do a part two with this collaboration. But as I said, guys, it's a beautiful one. Please check out our YouTube channel, subscribe to the YouTube channel, and share the love, man. If you want to learn some vegan stuff, if you know a person who doesn't eat meat, please check out our YouTube channel. All right, one hundred percent, guys. All right, so yeah. But otherwise, we got a lot more stuff coming in, and a lot more ideas will be coming from Chef Ricardo to you. Love with all. Have a wonderful evening, and I'm going to close the show. S G S T four. I am going to the market, and I'm getting all of those ingredients to make your awesome salad. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it, man. Have a lovely evening, and look after yourself, guys, and stay blessed. See you next time. Bye bye.